played Jeter Vagon Stanton's future with Marlins 200 in his first news conference with the Marlins, Derek Jeter answers questions about the type of ball club he wants and whether that will include Giancarlo Stanton. 200 Derek Jeter, the Miami Marlins' new CEO and part owner, is considering keeping four esteemed members of the team's front office whom he had reportedly wanted fired. Jeter reportedly asked in September for the dismissal of Baseball Hall of Famers Andre Dawson and Tony Perez, as well as Jeff Conine the former outfielder known as Mr. Marlin and 2003 World Series winning manager Jack McKeon. Jeter has since personally reached out to the four, and he informed them he did and to really intend to fire them and that he would be interested in retaining all four of them in roles to be determined, according to FanRag Sports. The apparent change of heart comes a day after Jeter and controlling owner Bruce Sherman spoke publicly for the first time on Tuesday about their group's $1.2 billion purchase of the Marlins. During that media conference, Jeter was noncommittal about keeping Marlins slugger Giancarlo Stanton, who led the majors in home runs 59 and RBIs 132 this season. We do have to rebuild the organization, Jeter said Tuesday. It starts with player development and scouting. We will build it from top down and bottom up. Stanton is three years into a 13-year contract, one that was seriously backloaded. He's still owed $285 million in that $325 million deal, and the Marlins lost money this season. Stanton said last week that he does not want to be part of another rebuild with the Marlins. The Marlins World Series champions in 1997 and 2003 concluded their eighth consecutive losing season, the longest streak in the majors.